You all have the building. The Northern Kibbe. Right, um, the Santa Apel, um, because somehow we can give them a heavy up. I'm blessed somehow I've got a thing like a big man, and so we've got a key that will be good for both child folks. I can work well the plan to my or Scott Van Rabon for with me. But it's a good night about the hour keep the wedding can in our thing. Welcome to you all here today. I'm very pleased to be here with the Chief Constable, Carl Faust, to open this fantastic building. I'm expect exceptionally pleased to see the children here from the Scott Van Rabon in Mall, and it'll be a pleasure to hear them sing in a few moments. It's also a pleasure to see so many of my former colleagues who I worked with in my time at Drexel and Flincher, and I must say they all look amazingly well, bearing in mind in the movie years they, they spent supervising me. When I come out of a fault, we put a hand on a deal left, and we should take the archie party in and a hand on a quiet And when I in person, when I never have, we should the archery, they have a hell of a check, Liz Bryan. So many people have been involved in this project and I would like to thank every one of them but there is one person I need to thank above all others and that is Liz Bryan, the project manager. Well commissioned in like an eager world there, the tickle hide and the headlay and cunning croissant at the feet, they all like a feet plan, so like where if I marry I see I start what down for pass off, so not to have the only community I can say live this one out, we see again I can work and live like a sand at the savon and not break me. As a Police and Crime Commissioner, I have a duty to ensure that the force can deliver an effective and efficient service which provides value for money, ensuring a modern estate which meets the needs of our communities and our policing family is extremely important to deliver a quality policing service in North East Wales. My head Bob Amster and Herr and then with Dick Van Cumna, Darian Nall and Nall, Belsinane, Vernon, Gwyneth and Hinder Breed. I'm a high bit salty, I believe no history, I know that, and the father way I feet feel. This is not always easy as we're facing some financial challenges, but we have to invest in our resources the most efficient way we can so that we can deliver the best service for our communities. And um, from speaking to people who work here, I, I notice a vast difference in, in um, you know, I think the way they feel, you know, the opportunities they have here compared to, um, to the old police station. Um, I, I know a lot of people were attached to Wrexham Police Station. Um, although I spent an awful many years there, I can't say I was one of them. And, you know, I was quite glad to, to come here and I, I'm sure um, all of us feel the same now that we settled in. So what? I'm pretty asking questions for any of you people who still love Carl folks in a particular area. I would now like to welcome Carl, the Chief Constable, to say a few words. Yeah, come on. Round up, round up. Uh, he uh, also have heavily um, Clyde, so welcome all to Clyde Police Station. When I first came over to apply for the job of Chief, it's very unnerving having all these people at Clyde. I'm just going to be going to get pelted and stoned around. Um, I, I actually went to Rexham, uh, I went out on patrol and then I met the commissioner there and I did think, oh my god, what am I going to do joining Air with this police station? And when you look at Rexall and you look at here and the difference that this will make for the future, it is massive. I think we all kind of get weighted to places we worked in and lived in. Um, but I think we worked and lived at our best out of Rexall to say a long time ago. And you look at it now when you drive past, and I think the uh, citizens of Rexall will be really glad when it finally comes down. Just hope it gets knocked down before it falls down. <laughs> so, uh, always a bit of a worry for me. Um, I am really pleased to be here today um, uh, to see the building finally formally opened um, uh, with the Commissioner and to uh, uh, all our guests here today. It is a real privilege to be the Chief Constable to see this. Um, you know, estates, it's always difficult to justify building and it's always difficult to justify spending money on buildings. But actually, when you look at the difference it has, it's gone. It's, it's gone. <laughs> gone. When you look at the, the difference it makes to the working environment, the integration, the contact that people have, you really do notice the difference. And that quality of life, that quality of uh, a light and environment, and somewhere that people are proud to come in to work with, I think it is really, really important. Uh, so the investment here, as we've seen in Clangevney, as we've seen in Clandidna, and as we'll see in other locations around the force, when we can get a bit of money to do so. 